what we got. Well, uh, you know, you got your money's worth out of the out of game. How did it go? You know, they, they probably had an advantage being on turf a little bit more than y'all did. I, I think that might have played a little bit into it. Um, going in. Was, yes. Yeah, definitely going in. Uh, I think it was a really physical game. Uh, you know, the, the goal that we gave up, it was a definite defensive mistake. Uh, we weren't ready for that ball bouncing over. And, uh, you know, keeper didn't come off his line fast enough. The thing that I got to give our guys credit for is just gritting it. You know, I told him, um, I told him when we got to halftime, all we needed was one more goal. We just had to find the uh, find the right opportunity. We went to the uh, weather break, 26 minutes left, and uh, you know it was. We had 26 and 31 seconds. Right. And all we had to do was find one. Right. How many minutes was left? Four. Four. That's all we needed. <laughs> we got to that second uh, that second opportunity in the uh, the overtime period, and uh, Dylan just. He hawked the ball and just buried it. I mean, just unreal. What were you? What did you want to do, or what did you use during the, the weather break to, to talk about anything, to change anything, to consider anything? What did you do? We um, we did change our formation. Um, you know, we we adjusted who we had in uh, in certain spots. And I actually, I can't remember if it was at halftime or if it was uh, going into uh, the weather break. But what we uh, what we changed was a uh, four five one to a three five two. Uh, we took a defender off and uh, added an extra forward, and that just put the pressure on them. That's how we scored the two goals. Did you gonna figure that that was gonna be the way it would work out? Yeah. Just like you drew it up, except you didn't want to go to overtime. Definitely didn't want to go to overtime. I, you can't draw us up any better. Right. That was one heck of a ball game. Did you worry? Did overtime favor you or them? Did you think going? On? I think it favored us. I think we had momentum. We had the uh, we had the energy, and. I mean, we really didn't go too far into uh, into our bench and use a lot of our guys who we had fresh legs if we absolutely needed to. We got them on the field in the right spots and they uh, they capitalized on it. Was there anybody, you know, you got two goals, you know, it was a physical game. Was there anybody that stepped up a little bit that the stat sheet's not going to show? Whether um, it's... I think Michael Barnes, uh, number five, played a heck of a role in the middle. Uh, he definitely played, you know, as physical as they were. Uh, and we matched up pretty well with that. Um, defensively, Avery Kirkland stepped on. He's one of our freshmen, and um, you know he played really great minutes there in the second half. Eden Kaninjing, number 21, we moved him from that left back to the right wing, and he just created you know a lot of uh, a lot of good opportunities. Um, I can't really pinpoint one person. Right. That was a total team effort. How different was? Uh, let's see. What was the score the first time y'all played them? Two to one. Oh yeah. Yeah. How different was the game? It was faster. It was a lot faster. This one? Yeah. Uh, I mean, when we played, it was cold. It was um, it was a little damp on our field, so mm -hmm. we were slipping and uh, moving around. Um, but, you know, the atmosphere, I think everybody got their money's worth tonight. How well did y'all play? Or was this a gutted out, this was a gutted kind out, out game? This wasn't yeah. the best soccer you played, but it was the, not, the clutchest. Not, yeah, not by, uh, not by any means, but, you know, our guys do what they needed to do, and they came out with it.